The question of ethics in brokering the Duffy deal. The lawyers who negotiated that deal shouldn't have done so. Was Harper's former special counsel on the wrong side of the law? A huge fallout from the Senate scandal tonight with new questions about the ethics of the prime minister's former lawyer. Benjamin Perrin was part of the PMO team that helped orchestrate the Mike Duffy cover-up. Stephen Harper says he had no idea what his special counsel was up to. But CTV News has learned the law societies of two provinces have been formally asked to find out. Ottawa Bureau Chief Robert Fife has the exclusive details. Benjamin Pear and the Prime Minister's former lawyer brokered a secret deal between Nigel Wright and Senator Mike Duffy. The deal the RCMP says may be a crime. CTV News caught up with him in Vancouver. Just a moment to talk to us. Off camera, Perrin said his legal counsel told him to stay quiet. And that's the advice that I've got. So it's, it's good advice. There's good reasons for it. But CTV News has learned a formal complaint has been filed against Perrin and Duffy's lawyer, Janice Payne. University of Ottawa law professor Amir Adaran filed a complaint with the B.C. and Ontario Law Societies saying, I allege that both these lawyers violated the ethics of the profession. If Mr. Duffy and Mr. Wright engaged in an illegal deal, and that's what the RCMP alleges, then the lawyers who negotiated that deal for them shouldn't have done so, that it wasn't ethical to do so. Questions too about Perrin's emails, which the RCMP says were deleted when he left Harper's office. All the emails from Mr. Perrin uh, relating to his role in setting up this deal have disappeared. Very, very disturbing. Even law students at UBC, where Perrin now teaches, have questions. I think it's deeply concerning, especially when they're trying to like teach us like the ethics of the profession and trying to say it's a noble profession. Perrin is not the only Harper advisor in trouble. Senator Bernstein Gerstein was deeply involved in the whole scheme to repay Mike Duffy's expenses. Why, Trudeau asked, is Gerstein still the party's bagman? Uh, Mr. Duffy claimed he had repaid his inappropriate expenses when in fact he had accepted a gift from Mr. Wright. It's non-answers like that that explain why the Conservatives lost 40% of their vote across the country. Liberal gains in four by-elections have spooked Tories upset about the Senate scandal. A former Tory cabinet staffer wrote to the Ottawa Citizen today saying, if we force Harper to answer truthfully or resign, we gain back our ethical platform. Harper may get a taste of how his MPs feel when he meets his caucus tomorrow. The first time since the fallout from RCMP revelations about a PMO cover-up of the Duffy Wright deal. Lisa. Okay, Bob Fife on a blustery Ottawa night. Thanks, Bob. So Justin Trudeau's liberals had their fair share to boast about last night, but the way Trudeau did it in his victory speech in.